All right, geeks, we're doing some great giveaways on the channel, so stay tuned to the end of the video, and I'll tell you what to do and how you can win. All right, geeks, we got the new X-Men wave. It's a combination of X-Men, X-Force, and Alpha Flight. Gonna unbox all of them and build the bath. You ready? Let's go. All right, so it's 11 o'clock at night. I gotta get up for work at five. Uh, I tried to go upstairs, but I could not go to sleep with this guy right here waiting on me. So um, I came back downstairs and I said, let me go ahead and do this unboxing. Because I, I just, I've been waiting on this. I've been dying for it. And I, there's no way I can go to bed without opening this. Uh, it's, I'm like a kid in a candy store. Mr. Sinister, man, love him, love him, love him, love him, love him to death. And um, when I took him out of the box, just how heavy and solid he was, made me want to check him out even more. So this is gonna be real quick. I'm just gonna do this unboxing so I can get to sleep. But I'm gonna let you see him out the box so you can bask in all his glory. Thank you, Wanda. All right, a scientific genius with evil intentions, Nathaniel Essex genetically alters his human form to become the shape-shifting telepath known as Mr. Sinister. I remember when Mr. Sinister uh, first came on the scene, I dug him more than Apocalypse. And Apocalypse, um, the way he came on, if you ever read the early X-Factors, I think it was X-Factor 5 or 6, where he first appeared in the shadows and then he appeared later on. Um, might be in the next book after that, but anyway, the build-up for him was great, and he was probably the baddest mutant at the time. But man, when Mr. Sinister came, that was it for me. And I think I talked about the Infernal storyline before that he was a huge part of. All right. So look at this dude, man. Look at that face. Ah. <laughs> All right, let me get him out. I'm... You know what I realized? I just busted my legend, Sherry. Um, this is the first normal legend that I've opened in a regular box. Everything else I've opened has either been a double pack or if it was a single figure, it was like a Rider series or something in one of the bigger boxes. I've never opened up a legend in a regular box before. This is my first one. So you all are witnessing a first. All right, so, oh, nice boots. There we go, let me just stand him up for a second. Look at that dude. That is a figure. Um, I am really impressed. Look at this guy. All right, so first and foremost, let's check out his face. Look at each of the individual teeth. Oh, that's a little blurry. I don't know if you, there you go. Look at each of his individual teeth, the raised eyebrows, the forehead lines, the dope haircut. So this looks like a brother. <laughs> oh man. It, oh, okay, so yeah. He bends at the waist. I almost didn't see that because the color matches up so perfectly. A lot of times you get a difference in paint here in the abdomen. Uh, I wonder why he didn't come with alternate hands. I might not want Sinister in a face. Oh, look at that. His wrist bends all the way back and forward. Is this a single joint? Yeah, it's a single joint. Oh, but the bicep does swivel all the way around. So you can do some good posing. Look at his open hand with his nails. Man, this guy's dope. And the blue is kind of a paintball metallic blue. I don't know if it comes across well on the camera. Uh, but man, it's beautiful paint. He's got his thigh highs on in case he wants to go to the club. I'll lift up the cape here. 
Oh yeah. Good paint job on this. I'm loving this cape though. The way it goes up and then cascades down like a waterfall. And the boots. Oh wow. The boots at the ankle swivel all the way around. And these guys ballet twos. Yes, he can do yoga. <laughs> Look at that. He can do a split. Yeah. So if you're thinking about getting this wave, and I know a lot of times it's tough to get the entire wave at once, if you have to pick a figure here, um, I would say that this would probably be my first figure. Now, as far as the characters go in this wave, my favorite character is Guardian, um, James Powell Hudson. But as far as look goes, I would say it would have to be Mr. Sinister or maybe Boom Boom. Um, Boom Boom looks tight inside the package. I, you know, when I take her out, you know, I could be right or wrong. But I would say you can't go wrong with Mr. Sinister. Um, he's not that hard to find, as far as I know. I got him from Hasbro Pulse. I waited a while, but um, I've been he's been out in the stores for at least three weeks um, I saw him at two game stops in South Carolina three weeks ago and he was at a game stop here in Atlanta about a week and a half ago so he's been around so find him if you can if you want him but I mean he's a really great figure oh I didn't even notice that his uh, I don't know what do you call this here a cowl or a headdress has the little cuts in there just like in the comic book man this dude is awesome I, again I can't get over that cape that cape is awesome and he's an easy stander you don't have to fuss with him at all he's solid and again this comes with the right arm of the Wendigo so we're gonna hold on to this and we'll build the Wendigo at the end Well, here's another close-up look at him. If you have any questions or comments about him, just hit the comment section. If you can, like and subscribe. We're doing some giveaways, so stay tuned at the end of the video to see how you can win some legend figures. Spread the word through social media. That's how we grow. Um, appreciate it. I just realized today that uh, we hit 150. And that is the first mark for our first giveaway, so I'll get on that this weekend. Um, I'm not sure when it happened. I hadn't checked in a few days, uh, so I was kind of surprised today. But thanks, because we've only been doing this since April, and we're already at 150. So that means I'm getting more than one follower a day, so that's awesome. And uh, you know, that's more can I, than I can ask for. And again, I'm trying to get better, so forgive me <laughs> if it's not as great as you want it to be, but I am learning. And I just want to share this journey with you because I love legends. I'm going to collect them all, unbox them all for you. And I know there are a lot of people that are just getting into it like I am. So even though as I go through the older legends, they've been shown a lot on YouTube before, there are a lot of people that aren't familiar with them and would like to see these figures to know which ones they would like to collect next. And I'm here to help you. All right. Thanks for checking this out. Enjoy, geek out. All right, geeks, so at 150 subscribers, we're gonna be giving away a Blink and Wonder Man figure. And then at 250 subscribers, we're gonna be giving away Jubilee and Scorpion. Then at 350, we're gonna give away the ever elusive Beast figure along with a Weapon X. All you gotta do to be eligible to win is subscribe to our channel, turn on notifications, and then go to our Instagram page, look for the post about these giveaways, and then repost them on your Instagram page. When you've done all that, come back to YouTube and comment on any of our videos, giveaway complete, and then you'll be eligible to win. We're gonna be giving away some gadgets too in the near future, so keep a lookout, because you're gonna have to come back and do something a little bit different. All right, geeks, good luck.